both these teams looking for a spark. Henrik Zetterberg always looking so serious. October 13th, the last time each of these teams won a game. First period, Vancouver working the power play. Alex Burrows to Chris Tanev. He fires it past the screen. Peter Morazic. Canucks have the lead 1-0 through one period. In the second, Detroit working the power play. Zetterberg dishes for Justin Advocator. He redirects it, but Ryan Miller with the skate save. Comes up big to keep it out. Later in the front, Canucks on the power play. Daniel Sedin, the chance in front. It gets past Morazic. It sits on the goal line. But look at Danny DeKaiser save it from going in on the same power play. Bo Horvat to Burroughs. He sets up Brandon Sutter, who buries his third. 2 0 Canucks through two. Third period. Thomas Tatar chips it ahead to Tangu Pulkin. And look at that move as he fights off Ben Hutton and then scores. The Wings down two to one. Man, he can skate. Under three minutes later, Detroit on the power play. Nick Cronwall over to Tatar. He waits and then risks it. Past the screen, Miller. We've got ourselves a 2 2 hockey game. We need overtime. Detroit came to play. Three on three. Not even Jax Teller could wake up from this. He does look exactly like Jax He's Teller. He's put on a bit of weight, though. Put on a bit of weight. In overtime, Mrazek, the nice outlet pass. Finds Gus Nyquist. Look at that snap pass Miller. What a win for Detroit. Vancouver, let it slip away. They blow a 2 0 lead to lose in overtime. That stinks. The Red Wings take it by a final of 3 2. They'll be happy with that. So the Canucks, 0 2 3 at home this season. They're 2-6-0 in their last eight games versus Detroit.